down is a time where self care and mental well being is more important than your job and deadlines. Today, the rules have changed, so let's take care of ourselves and our skin in the right way. I'm Dr. Shweta Nakwa, the consultant, dermatologist, and cosmetologist practicing in Thane. So, are you experiencing that quarantine skin or the stress skin? Well, stress releases a hormone called cortisol which can give you redness or irritation on your skin that break out or that greasy and oily skin. Also, the side effect of stress that is decreased in the appetite and also that sleepless nights. Not to forget those glasses of vodka and that wine which can give rise to dull and lifeless skin. Don't miss that sunshine. Sunshine is essential for vitamin D synthesis. It's also necessary for the cellular development and also reducing that redness and inflammation in your skin. So have some leisure time at early morning at your window pane and don't miss that egg yolks, mushrooms and salmon in your diet. Now use of masks and use of hand sanitizers. Now because of the frequent hand washing, what happens is that washing clothes and dishes the skin is getting drier and drier. Invest in a good hand cream which has lots of cocoa butter and shea butter. Wash your hands, pat dry your hands, do not rub your hands on a towel after washing it. Also, you can add a dash of coconut oil, olive oil and ghee to your favorite moisturizer and apply it liberally at night time to have a soft skin of your hands and feet. Now what happens when we apply mask? for fetching uh, grocery from the uh, shops or uh, on duty for essential service providers. Because of wearing the mask for a prolonged period of time, there is increase in the humidity in and around the areas of mouth and nose. As a result, one can get succumbed to bacterial infections or heat boils, fungal infections and also the dermatitis or redness due to the friction caused by the mask on your skin surface. Change your mask if it becomes wet. At indoors, do not touch your face. Apply moisturizer before application of the mask so that you can reduce the friction in between your skin and the mask. Now how to take care of that stressed skin? Hydrate yourself, drink lots of water. You can have lemon juice, your favorite fruit juices, lemons, strawberries, tomatoes, are all good powerful antioxidants and they are excellent sources of vitamin C. They can reduce the oxidative stress on your skin but not as a DIY skin care especially at your home and in those who have a sensitive skin. Instead one can use cool baths or you can use ice cubes or just cool water to cool your skin. Now in short how to take care of your skin right from cleansing to protecting your skin in this lockdown. Skin care should be short and sweet. Indulge in dual skin cleansing. First with micellar water, then with a cleanser, salicylic acid or tea tree oil for acne prone skin, a pH balanced facial cleanser for a normal skin. Moisturizer should more concentrate on the ceramides and the hyaluronic acid based instead of using an oil based moisturizers. Light moisturizers for acne prone skin, water based moisturizers for that oily skin, pamper your skin with vitamin C serums, moisturizers, facial mists, sunscreens and your face mist. All this should be recommended by a dermatologist as a new approach to your skin care in lockdown. For further queries, you can contact your dermatologist today.